Hello, Justin Sloan. Welcome to the Sloan Zone. Today I wanted to talk about a book by Michael Anderley, which is called uh, Death Becomes Her. It's the first in the Carthurian Gambit series. I don't know how to say that. <laughs> but let me just say that it's awesome. I've been reading it. I've been loving it. It's uh, If you're like vampire stories, if, you, if you're into that kind of stuff, you know, um, this is awesome. And it's not just regular vampires either. Like he took a whole new spin on it, which has to do with kind of genetics and whatnot. Now, you should read it to find out because that's really, in my opinion, like one of the most intriguing parts of the stories. Of course, the characters are also quite well done, emotional. It's awesome. Uh, I love the whole setup. Um, man, I, I, I don't want to spoil it at all for you. I'm just going to say that there's an honor code. There's vampires. They kind of have this military angle to them where there's good fighting bad. Uh, in many ways, that resembles the werewolf thing going on in my new novel, Hounds of God, which is, there's already a short story out there kind of based on it called Night's Curse which is like the prequel intro to Hounds of God, and that one's almost done. So I'd finished that, and I started reading this, and I was like, wow, this is awesome. It's very different from what I'm doing, but it's kind of similar in many ways. And Michael Andale is an awesome guy. I think there's like 12 or 13, maybe 14 even, uh, books in the series already. So if you want to get into it, uh, they're all free on Kindle Unlimited, so you could just get a Kindle Unlimited subscription and plow through them. And hey, so yeah, I'm going to say on the Sloan score, uh, it's, it's way up there. I would also say uh, some people criticize, myself included sometimes, you know, novels that kind of, uh, what they call it, head hopping, where you go from like one person's point of view for a paragraph, then you go to another person's point of view for a paragraph. Uh, I would say that's the only criticism you could give this book. Uh, however, even though I usually strongly despise that kind of writing, I'm actually liking it a lot here. It feels much more like a movie or a screenplay. And so as I'm reading it, I'm kind of, you know, getting more into the zone, into the characters and all that because it's uh, going back and forth. And he doesn't head hop like, you know, all the time. It's just kind of like a paragraph or a couple paragraphs or even a chapter. And then it might go like a paragraph and then a different paragraph for somebody else. So it's an interesting way of approaching it. And I think you'll like it. Take care.